Good morning, happy Saturday. Welcome back to the channel. Welcome to the first day of spring, spring opening day here at Uncle Charlie's cabin. We are here to cut a lot of grass, clean up some brush. Hopefully we can see some progress. So join us. Oh, look at that shot. You should get put you at your camera in portrait mode. <laughs> Built Chevy tough. It's not the saying. That's Ford. Like a rock. So first things first, new battery for the Skag. He couldn't get the OEM battery because Skag is only open, or the dealer is only open like, what'd you say, 10 to four, Monday to Friday or something? Yeah. Banker's hours, <laughs> so. Found this battery, which should fit in the slot, we hope. It's the same size as the other battery. Is that enough to not uh, arc on the seat when somebody sits down? Yeah, that's right there. Was the other one top post with yeah. like sticking up like that? I should blow the battery up. <laughs> Way my past 24 hours been going. It's really bad luck that you say that because remember what happened last year? First cut of the season is when I ran over that gigantic stick and then we discovered the belt was old and stretched and led to that month debacle. Yeah, yeah. Here we go again. Ready to go. Battery's fully charged. Both tanks are filled. Nope, not that one. blocks our path. This is where I forget I had a uh, cable plugged into the camera, so there's no audio with this. This is where I am explaining that uh, Charlie is going to be um, moving the uh, wood chips that we had cut up in a couple weeks ago, flattening them, flattening them out. So when I come over with the zero turn mower, um, I'm not going to get stuck. I'm not going to shoot chips everywhere. He's going to flatten this area out. And this is kind of what we do throughout the entire day. We, we kind of in tandem work through areas at the same time.
This is a note to self. Pick up your tarp that's been on the ground for five years. Oh, that's been we, long we've walked that. past it so many times. It's been a sometimes problem. And now it's a today problem. Really, that's the tooth that grab it. Yeah. That's the, that's the only one that's been wrapped around it. I think the drone was still in the air. The camera definitely wasn't recording because it was doing whatever it was doing.
And that is gonna be a wrap for this video. Um, I'm already driving back, I just left the cabin right now. Um, we got a good amount of cutting done. Got the, uh, the front yard done right in front of the house and then to the sides of the house and then the side field all the way back um, to the, I don't know, side front field. We need names for all these areas. But we, we got all that cut down again. It was really wet. The grass was soaked today. It, didn't, it hasn't rained that much up here, but the ground was completely soaked. I didn't get stuck at all, but definitely left some mud, mud tracks and trails everywhere. Um, but definitely got the, uh, the grass down to a manageable level. So now when the sun comes out, it'll probably, or it'll hopefully dry it out a little bit, a little bit easier. And then we cut away some of the, the winter brush. So that helped a lot. Um, and then Charlie was in the uh, Kubota MX and we were kind of, as you saw throughout the video, we were working in like a tag team kind of thing where I first did a perimeter around the area that I was going to be cutting in and then he would go back like behind me and pick out all of the things that I couldn't cut. Like if there was a tree on the edge of the road um, or on the edge of the, that path I cut, he would push the tree or pick it up and get rid of it. So the next time I cut um, in a few weeks from now, it'll be, it'll be a straight shot. I won't have to weave around around everything and it'll be a little bit easier so we, we kind of tag teamed with uh, with the uh, zero turn and the uh, Kubota and then in the backfield next to the barn we, we were really sinking there um, and let's not forget about Charlie's oops moment with the uh, with the tarp something had to happen to today I'm glad it was something that wasn't totally breaking the tractor but something had to happen and I guess that that was the uh, the thing of the year thing of the day but anyways hope you like this video this was the start of the 2024 um grass mowing clearing season here at Uncle Charlie's Cabin. This is in northern West Virginia. So this was our first 86 degree day. There's been a couple of 60, 70 degree days, but this was the first true hot, hot day. And the grass was at a, at a height where it's actually worth cutting. So happy spring. Lots of cuts ahead. See you next time. Peace. <laughs>